An attorney retained by Governor Chris Christie's office in Wake of Bridgegate requested an interview and documents from Hoboken Mayor Dawn Zimmer, which she declined through legal counsel of her own. The record broke the story Sunday night. Attorney Randy Mastro sent out virtually identical letters to Zimmer, her chief of staff, Daniel Bryan, her communications director, Juan Melly, and councilman Robbie Bala and David Mello, asking to conduct interviews and any accompanying documentation regarding Sandy Gate. The letter sent out on February 4th said the governor's office took the allegations very seriously. In January, Zimmer told MSNBC Steve Kornacki that Lieutenant Governor Kim Guadagno attempted a strong armor into approving a politically connected land development in the Mile Square City in exchange for Hurricane Sandy relief funds. The allegations immediately launched an investigation by the U.S. Attorney General. Zimmer's attorney in the matter, Gerald Covayton, stated in a letter of his own that Maestro's request would not be honored in light of the federal investigation. We question whether it's appropriate for the governor's office, in essence, to be investigating itself, particularly when an investigation of the same subject matter is being conducted by the U.S. Attorney's Office. Covayton wrote in a letter dated February 6th. Melissa Longo, the city attorney for Hoboken, gave Maestro a similar response on the same day, writing, it is the city's position that it is wholly inappropriate for the city, its employees, and elected officials to participate in the Office of the Governor's parallel investigation of itself at this time due to an ongoing federal probe. When reached via email, Melly told Hudson County TV that the letters answered the question why Mr. Mastro's request would not be honored. Mastro and Covey did not immediately return phone calls seeking comment from HCTV. I'm John Hines, Hudson County TV, Hoboken.